Channel 6 News Live at 5 continues with today's Family HealthCast. It is the leading cause of death for women. One in four will die from heart disease. But as Cerise Cole, uh, Cole tells us in this month's health check, being aware of the symptoms and risks unique to women, as well as making some heart healthy lifestyle changes, can really protect your heart and possibly save your life. For weeks, Tammy Ruskamp had symptoms. I thought it was just a real bad case of heartburn. By the time she got to the ER, she was in pain, sweating, and had a heart attack. Dr. Michael Denning says the challenge is for women to put their own health first. Okay. Knowing the risks and symptoms is a good start. And they can have numbness in their chest area and their arms, you know, anything in their upper chest or their upper back. A woman may just have extreme fatigue, uh, being uh, short of breath, dysmic, um, maybe nausea, uh, maybe back pain. Because many of those symptoms are vague, he recommends. If a woman has something that's new or different that she can't explain, something that she's not accustomed to, she should really see her physician. So if you don't want to end up here, there are a few things you can do to reduce your risk for heart disease. First, if you're a smoker, now's the time to stop. If you drink, limit your intake. You should talk with your doctor about what's best for you. Also, it's a good idea to get on the scale every now and then to make sure you're maintaining a healthy weight. Really, it's made me take a look at what I can do from now on. Um, I have gotten on a regular exercise program. I really watch what I eat. I limit my sodium intake, limit my fat intake. Just what doctors want from all women, to be aware and take charge of their heart health. In Fremont, with photographer Jeff Sabin, Cerise Cole, Channel 6 News. Some women are more at risk for heart disease than others. As women get older, especially after menopause, their risk increases. African-American and Hispanic women also have a greater risk, along with women with a family history.